and hello YouTube this is GS Massmart and I'm here with a new tutorial for all the uh, YouTube viewers out there uh, anyone who's interested in uh, Macintosh would actually really like this tutorial so uh, basically what I'm going to be showing you today is how to turn your uh, Windows PC and if, if you're one of my recent viewers uh, you, you should know that I have a Windows 7 uh, PC but now as you can see I have the dock here at the bottom the menu bar at the top here uh, I even, I, even have to, I even have the new trash can here. Uh, we click the finder over here. I have the same way the Mac looks. Even the sounds are the same. So um, this is really cool, I think. And, and you know, if you can't afford the two thousand dollar, three thousand dollar, a thousand dollar, you know, Mac laptops or computers, you know, then and you, and you just like the look of it, then this is perfect. So this is free. You can you can turn your uh, PC into a Mac very easily, and it's free. So let's go ahead and show you how to do that. Uh, even the animations are the same. Everything is almost the exact uh, same. Uh, as we can see here. Uh, minimize same way. So this is the website. I'm going to be linking this to you in the description. Let me go to the uh, home page though. Let me just uh, re -go let me go to the page again. You'll be brought to this page right here. Line transformation pack. Uh, the Mac OS X Lion Pack is the most recent uh, pack for the Mac, so you're, be, you're basically getting uh, the latest version. Uh, I don't know if they updated the site, but it, I think they do update this site. So when the Mountaineer or Mountain Lion comes out, then you can go and check here also. So I would suggest you favorite this. But when you get over here, you just click the Download Lion Transformation Pack here. Click this button right here in blue, and you scroll down. And right here it says get LTP. It says get LTP uh, one uh, period zip line transformation pack. You click this, and at the bottom here it'll, it'll pop. Up, if you have Internet Explorer, it'll pop up in the center of the screen. Mozilla and Safari and Oprah it'll pop up in a separate window. And if you have Google, it should pop up at the bottom here. But when it finishes downloading, you can minimize this. And when it finishes downloading, you can go to uh, your downloads here, and you click LPT1, this right here. And all you have to do is click the Line Transformation Pack EXE file, this application here, and it'll go and uh, extract itself, and then. Uh, it, will ask you, it, will, it will ask you for permission. You click yes, and then this will pop up. Now uh, you can change the background. I just haven't changed the background yet. But you can change it if you want. I would suggest you keep all these settings the same, uh, unless you already have a dock. I have a separate dock. I got my dock off the internet. Uh, uh, I got a what is my dock called? Uh, rocket dock. I have rocket dock, so you can get rocket dock and, and install it separately. But if you if you just want the regular dock, they give you here. They give you a dock here, so you can just keep this one if you want. But I had some problems with it, so you don't need to keep it if you don't want to. So after that, uh, if you want, keep all the settings the same. You can play around the settings here, and all you have to do is click. It'll say it'll say install. I have it as uninstall because I already have it installed. But you can just put install. There'll be a button here that says install, and then it'll install everything and it will restart your computer and then basically you'll be there with your Mac computer uh, your display visuals and everything so that's how you do it right there and um, I hope you all enjoy the tutorial hope you enjoy your new Mac look if you're interested in it and thank you all for watching as usual uh, subscribe if you'd like to and this is GS Man Smart I'll be back sooner you think don't go anywhere